outside to see it for yourself. Those thugs out there are just waiting to cause trouble for anyone coming or going. She sizes you up. Maybe they would have let you pass, however. Tell me about, tell me more about your business. <clears throat> she rubs the back of her neck. It's not doing as well as I'd like with all this trouble. I run an honest enterprise. Just trying to give folks a little rest and relaxation. She nods at you and lowers her voice. If, if you help me out, and I'll see about getting you a special discount. Yay. Uh, can I ask you about something else? Woo. Oh, okay. <clears throat> a knowing... A... Mm, a knowing grin warps her blue markings. Now, just what can I do for a comely lass like yourself? Uh, is there some he someone here named Cyril? Like, isn't that nice? She's like, ooh, what can I do for you? Like, hey, is there another lady here? <laughs> I'm, do I'm, I'm done dealing with you, sorry. <laughs> is there another person? She laughs. Ha ha ha. You must be new in town, dearie. She's only the most sought-after girl in the district. You want to spend time with her? Just ask. She's a thousand a night? But she's worth every pound. Or so they tell me. Uh, how about new? Fancy a girl with her? She, she nudges you in the ribs. Best money you can spend in the gift. Uh, maybe another time, because fuck that. Well, okay, hold on. Sure. Let's pay a thousand. Good God. You better get like perma buffs. You'll find her quarters upstairs. She lays a large hand on your shoulder. Don't mind the barely fellows at her door. They're just there to make sure everyone has a good time. Chingling. Okay, I don't really want a quick save in case this this ends up being Hail and well met. Uh, any of your regulars are for they've got to earn their ale. Take a look. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, so we have we have a fair bit of money. Gafea, Gafa, I guess. Um. <laughs> chief, hi, chief. That's dealing. Who is it ever? She's got big hands. <laughs> and Louis Amadon. All right, let's see what Wade has to say. Um, Wade's eyes are red-rimmed and unfocused. He stares into a filthy mug as if searching for something. He shivers and takes another drink. Perhaps you've had enough to drink. His eyes are filled with shame and self-loathing. What do you want from me? Uh, I heard about Darren. Are you okay? Wade turns the mug in his hands. No, not at all. I was taking the boy fishing, and I just wanted to stop on the way for a drink. A quick one. So I told him to wait outside for me. I only meant to stay a few minutes, but by the time I came out, he was gone. And you sit here still? She snorts. He stares at his mug again and takes a quick drink. I don't know what I'm going to tell Otta. Well, don't be so hard on yourself. You didn't mean for this to happen, you son of a bitch. <laughs> oh, God. I, I, I don't want to be benevolent right now. That's no excuse to sit here. Get your ass out there and look for him. You think I haven't tried? Wait, you think I haven't tried? I've lived in Andre's gift all my life. When someone's been missing this long, where he turns his back to his drink and takes a long gulp. This place is like the size. Oh my god. All right, whatever. We saw Andre's gift. 
It was like seven houses. Surely everyone knows each other. Lorenia. Not that. Nah, mm. I'm here. Oh, Ikali. Aldwin. Becky. The special lounge is for members only. Can I? Can can I? Uh, yes. We'll take the harlot. Late in the where there's a pick. Just do a, a little way. quick unlock the doodles. It's finished. Never mind. Never mind. Okay. Nope. <laughs> Got it. Don't enter. Just unlock. <laughs> Sure. I'll see it done. It's finished. Thanks. All right. Oh, what's this? Hello. What do we have here? Big old bed. Nothing too awesome. You decide soloing the bear with a low constitution melee cipher on hard. Two bears mauled you in one hit. Sounds about right. All right, all right. Let's get a let's get a close up on 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 this bay. Gods keep you. Powder almost hides the circles under her eyes, and ro Rouge rogues, <laughs> Rouge dusts her two prominent cheekbones. Despite it all, Cyril is beautiful. She favors you with a smile she must have practiced and perfected. Hello, stranger. Let me make you more comfortable. Um, there's something I need to discuss with you. She runs a smooth finger along your neck and under your chin. Just tell me what you like. It's extra if you want to bring someone else in, though. <laughs> uh, your friend Thristwin sent me. He, he needs that medallion. So do I. She raises her chin. I offered him half of, his, half of the money, and he refused it. She, crossed, she crosses her arms and paces in a slow circle around you. I'm sure he told you all about his broken clan. Did he also tell you that I got him where where he is today? Sure didn't. I really am sorry for him, but I bet you anything he lives better now than he did in Air Glanfeth. I've worked a long time for a way out, and I'm not giving it up just because Thirstwind suddenly got nostalgic. Um... Let's, let's forget about the medallion. I'd like you to help me find something else. Her shoulders relax and the kittenish smile returns. That's the spirit. What? No! Oh, I because I paid a thousand. What's my buff? How long does it last? Does it not say? Is it just forever? I'll take forever. Two to athletics, two to constitution, two to dexterity. All right. Good day to you. Let's talk about Thrustman and the medallion. Uh, I'll buy it from you. Six thousand fucking copper. Uh, damn it, damn it. Uh, okay. Welcome. Thurston has no right. I'll tell him to leave you alone. Wait, what? She's. Hail and well met. Uh, would you? I can cer certainly make it worth your while. Okay. Can I take half of his money? Six thousand copper. Mm-mm. That's some high roller bullshit right there. Is that locked? Nope.
All right, so those thugs ran dis away. So maybe the kid is run off to teach his dad a lesson. We can only hope. Thousand copper. Hi, dollar hose. They better not let me do some quadruple. Oh, they, they better. Oh, that's a. Uh, you're definitely getting your money's worth there. Can we, can we? Oh, we can walk across. Sweet. Are we getting anywhere? Really? Just two fucking gold platers? All right. Run faster. So, man, we have a lot to do. This one city is like 17 quests. Oh, hey. What have we here? Another tourist in the gift. He nods to his, his shifty-eyed companions. Let's give her a proper welcome. Uh, let's talk this through. He draws a sharp blade. I'm afraid you're missing the point, friend. Are we? Are are we though? Are we? You sure? You sure you want to do this? You you want to tussle? You want to tussle? You want to poke the bear? We got a bear. Uh, wow, she's about to die. Where are you at, girl? Is that you? Let's do that. You will. Boom. Let's go. Stand. All right, we actually need to set up her. Um. Wow, oh, just that, yeah. Not ah, sure. Eh? Ripping pepperonis, nerds. Wow. Hey, we got a key. This old key looks like it's been rusted from years of exposure to salty air. Right, but where does it lead to? Gimme, gimme. Let's attack a full, well-equipped party of six people with two animals for a few coin. Right? Like, why would you mess with a bear and a wolf? Like, I mean, people aside, a fucking bear. <laughs> uh -uh. Never catch me messing with a bear. God's damn that son of a crew. The angry wormen. Wormen. Clenches her jaw and stares out towards the harbor with glimmering golden eyes. Eventually sensing your presence, she turns her feathered head toward you. Want to run a down on a select Valiant trading company? If you have more than half a brain, you could really do something with it. She clenches her jaw and continues quietly. As long as you're willing to clean up a, flu a few bloodstains. Diplomatic is stupid as shit. Quick question, what's your PC? A ranger? And who did you choose to join you? All NPCs or some hirelings? Um, they're all NPCs except one. I made a rogue, because I wanted a rogue. And yeah, I picked a ranger because I thought it was really good. I should have picked a rogue. <laughs> um, I like being clever, clever's good. Enough silver and gold you'd be surprised how well you can clean just about clean up just about anything true enough rosano's just lucky no one's trying to pay him and steal these days she grits her teeth